Hey, Shiva Rajaya here from VitalCoaching.com. Well, <laughs> the trek in uh, Parangla was uh, was really amazing. A fantastic uh, success, four days of adventures in this uh, beautiful valley to cross rivers and stayed up there. So these beautiful uh, wild horses. Anyway, this has been like a couple of days ago. I arrived in Somoriri, met a French couple over there who was taking uh, their jeep and their driver and their uh, guide back to uh, Toulé, so I took uh, the ride back with them. Arrived in Lay yesterday and today I thought let's go to Likir, because guess what, I, um, I was in Thailand a few months ago, met uh, Omani and uh, another group of friends who tell me well, we have this very nice uh, homestay in Likir. So um, Likir is about uh, 30 kilometers from uh, from Le. I decided to come over here. Uh, the driver, taxi driver, who takes me here, a young guy, picks up a, a Ladaki woman on the way, and she somehow gives him the wrong directions. Uh, summarizing the story, I end up in the Likir Monastery, which is this amazing, beautiful thing. So I keep asking about the no-mind homestay uh, from my friend. Nobody knows where it is, but this guy from the monastery uh, comes to me and, um, and just takes me to the kitchen of the monastery and says, here is your room for tonight. <laughs> so I go like, uh, great, fantastic. Um, so I didn't find the No Mind, but instead I'm in the No Mind Monastery, uh, which is a, an amazing place actually. <laughs> I was looking for a homestay and instead I end up here. I'm going to show you a little bit around because it's uh, quite impressive and uh, it's a little bit like a medieval labyrinth, uh, very special, and uh, look at the landscape. The light is amazing and it's uh, very warm temperature and uh, we have all these um, you know pathways and it's uh, pretty impressive so this guy from the kitchen who gave me chai is, oh, here is your room for tonight. I go like, wow, oh, great, fantastic. You know, as I am, this is like perfect, beautiful view. And uh, if you go towards this window, look who I have over here. Magnificent, powerful statue of uh, Maitreya, the Buddha. So Maitreya is supposed to be the, the Buddha of the future, right? He is the expression of um, of the Buddha, but as as he will, he will come. It's a little bit like an expression of the Christ, also, you know, and um, yeah, somehow a figure, a divinity, uh, an avatar, a manifestation, divine manifestation, which is supposed to be coming in uh, in the future. He's drawing some. Uh, this is some uh, cheese, very salty. really uh, 
and the leash is made from um, yak butter. I'm just going to take you not into the, the whole monastery, but just show you a little bit what is. This is the way down into the toilet. Welcome to the toilet. To shower here, you need to do what you need to do. And this is the bathroom. I mean. Use a little bit of, uh, bring some water, and so on. This is my friend, hey. our cook. <laughs> Very nice man. Yeah, yeah. He's taking care of. Let's follow him. Oh look! I think they make noodles. Okay. Noodles here. Yeah. Anyway. So it's really uh, mm. very nice. I'm just going to show you the kitchen because it's like a living museum. It's really amazing. Pots and pans. Where you do the dishes. Look at this collection of pots. This thing here is to make uh, the um, um, buttermilk, butter, butter tea. It's really, uh, I love the taste of it. Some people cannot stand it, but it's really nice. Mysterious kind of uh, labyrinth, and this is how we come. Uh, we come in. Well, this is back to my uh, to my space, but there is another exit over here. Now we are in the in the monastery area. Just going to show you a little bit around. Again, walking through the labyrinth of the monastery. You know, it's so impressive. I love it. Of course, they used to build these monasteries in places that are not only special for the energy, but are also like conductive for being like a like a fortress in case uh, wild invaders come. Statue is like uh, 20 meters high. Coming in this uh, beautiful valley, and if you go up uh, there, this is direction north. You arrive in uh, Nubra, Nubra Valley, which is uh, apparently very sacred and. 
du tifo là se voir. And then you have uh, you know the rooms of the monastery. covered with most amazing representations of Buddhas, Taras, and so on. Just to give you a small impression of how uh, beautiful and refined everything is. So, I was looking for No Mind homestay, and uh, this is where I ended up instead. So, I'm going to sleep over here tonight, uh, meditate, and um, call for inspiration for the next uh, week to 10 days of my trip before I take off back to Europe. I'm very touched by what happened today. As you can imagine, this is very special. I'll see you soon, bye bye.